We're in the Bacon and Eggs Pop Art Skatable Sculpture in Wilkeson, Washington. I'm John Hilding, and I had this fantasy for this park, presented the idea to Mark Hubbard about seven years ago, and I said, I've got this fantasy about bacon and eggs. Could you build something like that? And he said, we can build whatever you want. Mark was a genius building skate parks. He founded Grand Line, a company responsible for many, many, many skate parks here in the country. Sadly, in 2018, Mark passed away, but Grand Line came with John's Big Breakfast project. And so I brought my wife's frying pan from home, and he scale, it's a scale model of my wife's frying pan. The bacon is 30 feet. Everything goes better with bacon. Those are, I would say, over easy. The yolks are soft, right? It is putting Wilkeson on the map. On the internet or social media, with all the skate skaters that post as far as this is on our agenda. We've got to come and skate bacon and eggs. Well, we came from Bremerton, Washington, only about an hour and a half away. Um, we came because I've been watching like the frying pan get made the past three years. We love it. Good family frying pan for everybody, yes. <laughs> it is fun and you can do tons of tricks. I kind of like the eggs. Mm, the bacon. I've only seen two people that can ride the handle and then they air onto the bacon. Because it's like a five foot gap. I knew that my dream would come true when Thrasher Magazine covered this and someone just sent me a few minutes ago the new video that Thrasher has done. Bacon and eggs is not John's first crack out art. You see what it did there? I know, not so good. He helped start Bumbershoot, where he hung a giant windsock from the Space Needle in those early days. Also, he hosted a crazy performance art in the 70s. And this was an event called Media Burn with a custom 59 Cadillac driving through a pyramid of burning television sets. His brain's a little scrambled. I think that's a pretty good one. This old day breakfast has brought John some new fans. What makes me happiest is seeing the use that it's getting. Long after I'm gone, kids are gonna be playing in bacon and eggs. So how cool is that? Come ride bacon and eggs.